Welcome to the Wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. It's good to see you. If this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. In tonight's shave, I am using my Gold Dollar 66. Oh yeah, we honed this up a while back. That's probably maybe half hollow. Now, this shave is inspired by Frank. I will go ahead and leave a link to his channel uh, in the description. Okay, Frank is in Sweden and I have been watching him a little bit here and there and it's interesting. I really enjoy it. So he did a, a shave recently, a budget shave and this is how I started, okay? I didn't necessarily start with this gold dollar 66. I started with a gold dollar 800. But now I picked this up for $5.35, okay, on eBay. I did have to hone it, but that's okay. And then, then I bought myself this Vanderhagen premium shave set comes with a brush soap puck and a ceramic bowl excellent excellent I picked this up on sale probably between seven and eight dollars okay for everything okay cheap way to get into wet shaving right there all right and here's what the soap puck looks like all right the Vanderhagen soap and now this is to me has a clean sit um, kind of maybe reminds me a little bit of when the kids were younger all right uh, to me it's not offensive uh, some people may think it is and it could be to you so you know I would say uh, check it out if you can find it for a good price you can definitely get a great ceramic bowl okay and you can get a marvelous little boar hair brush, okay? And this is premium boar hair, really good. They do treat this somehow because it really came out uh, much softer than you would think it would, all right? So now, let me pour off that bloom water because I, I bloom all my soaps. So we're gonna pour off that bloom water and put it on its pre-shave, yeah. All right. And this is a premium soap for them. And I think it has good performance. It really does. For an inexpensive soap, it is really nice. All right. So now, let's get that brush loaded all right there's that puck right there let's get that brush loaded and tell me how you doing yeah hopefully you had a good New Year's right and everybody's safe hopefully hopefully I got everybody back all right because uh, I would miss you I really would and you know how your shaves going you're having good shaves I hope so I hope you're having good shaves and maybe even some great shaves. Yeah. I know I was talking to uh, George here the other day, George Campbell, and uh, he has been having some great shaves off his Charnley Forest stone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that's good. It is. Yep. And uh, hopefully you had time to be uh, with friends and family over the holidays, yeah, and got some downtime. That's always good. And you made it to the midweek shave, yeah. Oh yeah, hump day, yep. So now, it's downhill to the next weekend. And now this Friday, I've got a Straight Razor Edge Friday special for you. Now, I do Straight Razor Edge Friday specials. The uh, first and third Friday of every month. 
and you can check that out. All right. Now, uh, you could also, in the comments, you know, ask me a question, give me a suggestion for Friday special, or, uh, you know, that kind of thing, because that's what I make Friday specials out of, is your questions, comments, and suggestions. Now, this coming Friday, Jody made a suggestion, and uh, you're going to get to see it. Yep. Yeah. All right. So, heads up, Jody. Yep. Yeah. All right. Now, that soap is good and pasty. Check that out. Excellent. Excellent. Now, I'm just going to go ahead and clean up around the bowl like I always do. Okay. I've always done that. And put most of that on the brush. Put the rest on with the pre-shave treatment. All right. There we go. Now, let's go to town with this little brush. And again, this is really a good budget shave because you can actually learn how to shave uh, with a straight razor and get into it uh, for not too much money. You know, you don't have to have the most expensive brush and things like that. And, uh, you know, you can, you can, you know, really try it out and see what's going on and see if you're even like it. And like the full dollars, you know, they're good beginner razors and uh, good travel razors for that matter. I also like uh, the ZY razors. They're again Chinese razor, just like Gold Dollar. Uh, I've had good luck with them as well. So, you know, you don't have to spend a ton of money to get into this. You could go ahead and just in a little bit and try it on and see if you like it. Yep, there you go. Look at that. This is so good. I think I could still put some water on it though. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, brush is losing a few hairs, but I'm telling you, it's an old brush. All right. I used it a lot. There we go. Nice. And that little handle is so cute, that brush. All right. Now, this is pass one, and that's going to primarily be with the grain, okay? Now, also, let me remind you right now that I do these uh, Shave of the Day videos every Wednesday and Sunday. So stop on by. You can watch another one, all right? Now, here we go. Yeah, just blowing it away. Cutting right through. Blue right through it. Oh, yeah. Nice.
Alright, check it out. Man, good cushion. Really, for the price, you get everything you need. Excellent. Absolutely excellent. Nice. All right. Now, switching hands, we're going to do this other side. Now, if you've never tried switching hands, you can always try it. And you may find you can reach places that you couldn't reach the other way. All right. With just one hand. Yeah, just blowing right through it. Nice. Nice, there you go. Check that out. Isn't that great? All right. Now, and it's been a long time since I've used this soap. It really has. Yeah, there are some fantastic artisans out there, but uh, this is a good way to get started. It really is. Yeah. Nice. Pass one complete. Yep. Looking good. Looking good. All right. Let's get that washed off. It blew right through the whiskers. You know, that's a $5.35 razor. And it will hold an edge. Definitely will. All right. Nice. Okay. Now, this is pass two. Yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the Christmas Eve special and the New Year's Eve special. If you missed them, you can always click right up here to see them, all right, and check it out. You know, I really appreciate you guys. And I appreciate all your feedback and, and really wonderful comments that uh, I get. Just excellent. So know that I really appreciate you. I do. And I thank you. 
from the bottom of my heart. I really do. Okay, we're gonna put a little more water on that. And it's exploding. Nice, nice. Okay. There we go. All right. Now, this is past two, and it's primarily going to be uh, against the grain here on my cheeks, against the grain here, and on my neck on the sides. That's going to be across the grain. I did a north to south to start with. This will be south to north on, uh, and, and it'll still be and across the grain, not against the grain, here and here, okay? And it does work. It, every time you do it, you get closer and closer, even if you go same direction. There we go. Nice. Really good. And it's always good to just have a simple shave. You know, nothing fancy. Don't need it. Switching up that hand. Nice.
here we go. Okay. Now switching hands again. Nice, nice. complete yep looking good looking good so far now let's get that washed off oh yeah wow and there is some serious residual slickness with this soap so if you need to go back and do any kind of a touch up or clean up you could and it would be easy enough to do you really could all right now this is the half pass and that is primarily going to be against the grain on my jawline and my neck and that's all I need to do and then I'll be set yeah. And seriously, this is how I started, is with this Vanderhagen Premium Shave Set. So, it's a good way to start. That way you don't have to really lay out, you know, a whole bunch of money trying to find out if you like to do something. When you never know. So for me, it turned out really well because I really enjoy this. And it it's just wonderful. I unplug and just get to spend uh, time with you. So let's do it. All right. This is the half pass. about to fall off there we go yeah that'll work
Nice. Really good. Good shave. For not much money. Oh yeah, nice. Okay. Now that is a beautiful shave. Sweet. All right, let's get that cleaned off. Nice, real nice, and there is a little spot. There we go, all good, yep, all right, so now, everywhere and again actually the alum is nothing more than uh, under a gear that I I buy and you just get it in the crystal I normally break the the little box off of it, that twisty thing, but uh, it just, I find it's easier to use this way. All right, and I didn't show you. All right, there's Lavender Witch Hazel, which is gonna work beautifully with this, okay? And we just put that everywhere, everywhere. It's good stuff. Yes, it is, okay. And to top off this show, we are going Nivea Poche Bomb. And this is a sensitive skin version. Really, really works well. And uh, I like it. I just do. I like taking care of my skin. And it works good. All right. There you go. Nice. All right, hey, you click right up here to see why you can't hone a straight razor and find out the secret, okay? And I appreciate you, thank you so much for stopping by. Really good to see you. You can click right over here to see my latest video. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.